It's like going wearing your best outfit to, to school, you feel me? Like the first day of school, you know, and then you get to be drippy. Oh, it's, it's a blessing, you know, to be able to do what we do and wake up and do what we do every day. I feel like home, I feel like I'm going to work. My dad always told me when I was young, hey, do something you love to do. I have your reason that you want to go to work. Don't wake up because you got to wake up. Wake up because you want to wake up. And that's why I look forward every day when God wakes me up is for me to go to practice. These guys come to work every single day. With nothing's going to be the bare minimum, we're going to do everything at a, at a high pace and elite level. As a coach, all you can do is be happy to see that. You know, I mean, you know you're on the right path. Uh, it, was, it was a bit emotional because uh, I'm one of the seniors on the team. It's my last year. So uh, it, was, it was a little emotional, you know, letting it sink in that, all right, man, you know, this, uh, one of these downs could be your last. You never know what it is, but I'm playing every day, every practice, every snap as if it was my last. We're a good, disciplined ball club, and I feel as if Coach Park is doing a good job of making sure that everybody stays consistent and make sure we stay on task and keep the focus and uh, hold everybody to the standard. These guys are stuck to what, everything we've asked, so and they've done it at a high level. So, you know, camp has been going excellent, and, and I think these guys are hungry to see somebody in a different color jersey. We are going to go 15 consistent weeks. That's how you finish. You got to go 15, 16, however long it's going to take to get those to get those uh, to get those goals accomplished, and just stay consistent. That's what we mean by finish. I would say Virginia Union football. It helped me understand myself more, and it helped me become a man, and made me actually get closer to God. Believe it or not, I was already close, but it just made me get deeper in faith, especially breaking down with the Our Father's Prayer every day, and it's just like. It's just great to be here. Great. And if you if you're a part of the Virginia Union organization as far as the, the football team goes, you'll probably pray about five times a day. You know, just in terms of when we break practice, we don't move without prayer. So because we need it. You know, so um, everybody around here knows that, and um, you know, it's just a part of what we do. When I got here, and it's like every Sunday during camp is a day that we're going to church, and it's like some days people don't feel like going to church. I haven't been to church in the past seven years until I got here because when my grandma died, that was something me and my grandma did. And it was like, coach said it's a team activity. So when I go there, it's the word that we got from everywhere we went to. It, it, it really wakes you up and makes you want to get closer to God. I, I, I really want to say last week, or was it two weeks ago, that at least 13 of our players and one of our coaches got baptized and got themselves closer to God. So that tells you that what Virginia Union is bringing. You know, we talk about play 411. A, a portion of that is Proverbs 411. You know, um, I will lead you in the ways of wisdom and direct you along straight paths. So, you know, um, it's the way I got to lead these guys. It's the way I, you know, I got to show them what I did, show them how I did it, even the things I did right and the things I did wrong. You know, I'm just kind of keep them on those straight paths. Um, and it's, it's, it's a faith-built program. Everybody already knows we'll be 10 in the box, but it's like this year now, that the pieces we got, the depth that you got, if you focus on three, you're going to mess up my door because anybody can play at any given time. Like Isaac and Monty said, them freshmen that we got, it's, it's, it's a lot of freshmen that we got to come in here to do something big. And they read the ball now. And it's just like, they all is like monkey see, monkey do. So it's basically what they see us doing and how they see us acting, how they see us balling, how they see us performing, they just fall in right in. Like the game might be a little too fast for them, but then once they get the system down, they rolling and then you can you can pick them in any time, any given time of the game. They gonna show you they ready to play. You're gonna win this thing with guys that you bring through the program. So we wanna bring as many guys through the program as possible. You know, um, you know, like everybody else, we'll 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 touch the transfer portal and, and bring in guys like that, but um you gotta you know understand that sometimes, you know, um, are you willing to sacrifice culture because they're coming from different places. You know, sometimes we're just not willing to sacrifice culture. You know, if somebody buys in, they fit into what we got going on, we'll bring in a, that type of guy. But other than that, we'll, we'll bring in grassroots guys, high school guys, and let them come through the system of what we're doing. So, you know, um, and they fall in line. I think when you have such a good, great group of leaders, you know, and your upperclassmen, you know, it makes it a little easier to get those guys to respond a little different. So, you know, um, our freshmen are responding. You know, um, and hats off to our coaching staff for doing a great job in recruiting all of those guys. So. Union football is a great place to be. That's all you can really tell everybody. Come find out they simple. We're going to win. We're going to win a lot of football games. I want to ring. I want to leave with some rings. I want to go all the way. I want to go all the way. Yes, sir. Man, I feel great. 